Hello friends, in this tutorial I will show to you how to move existing Windows 11 or Windows 10 from your old hard drive to SSD without new Windows installation. To do this, you need more space on any other drive or external drive than the drive used space on which your Windows is installed. You will need to download a free tool from the internet. The link is in the video description. And you can access this site by clicking on the link. Scroll down and select Download Free in Reflect 8 Free Home Version. Select I need personal free license and enter your email address below. Then click on Continue. Select No Thank You and click on Continue. Close it. Open the email from the crime software and click on the link. The download may have started. Click on downloaded file. Click download button. After the download, installer will open. Select Next. Click on Next. Select I accept the terms in the license agreement and click Next. Tick on the software is being installed for personal. And then next. Uncheck register this installation of Macrium Reflet. And click next. Again next and click on install. Click on Finish button. When the Macrium Reflet software is opens, tick all the drives with Windows logo and untick the rest of the drive. Click on image selected disks on this computer. Select destination folder where you want to backup. Select destination where have more space.
Select Next. Leave default selection. Click Next. Click on Finish. When the pop-up window opens, click on OK. Wait patiently until the backup is complete. After the backup completed successfully message will be displayed. Close it. Click on existing backups. You can see your backup here. Select the backup. Click on restore button. Click on Select Different Target Disk. Here you can see your existing HDD and SSD. Select SSD. If there is any partition existing in SSD, remove it. Select Partition and click Delete Partition. Click on Next button and then finish. When it's finished restore completed message will display. click on OK button. You can now use your SSD as a bootable drive. Restart Windows. Change first boot device's SSD. Your C drive have been changed to an SSD, and the old C drive have received a different drive letter.
Thanks for watching my videos. Subscribe me if you like this channel and please share if you like the video.